Well, just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening. It's absolutely ideal. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. And tonight we've got the semi-final of the Champions League coming up for you. It is FC Copenhagen facing Manchester City. Well, what a moment for both these teams. Just one step away from the final. But it's the visitors and their fans that are expecting to get through to the big day. But this is by no means an easy game for them, as their host can be really dangerous if they play at their best. today well they're going to play with two wingers in this 4-3-3 formation so they need to switch the ball quickly and get crosses into the box but they also need to get at least two midfield players making runs into the penalty area that's a must And so the starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson stands between the posts. Bernardo Silva plays alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield. And handed the task of playing up front is Erling Haaland. And they kick off here. Diogo Gonzalez. Useful looking position, you've got to say. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Lack of guile with regard to that cross. Goalkeeper's ball. Well, not many would debate the point that Erling Haaland is a joy to watch whenever he's out there on the pitch. But what should we expect from him today, Stuart? Well, Derek, he's a great all-round player, but it's his ability to run in behind defenders that makes him such a threat. And when he gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper, he usually scores. Holland, And now Rodri. And Bernardo Silva has it to give them the advantage. And there it is! The first goal! semi-final a huge moment extraordinary scenes well as the replay shows us this is the way to beat tight marking just look how he turns with the ball that's a fantastic goal you have to say Well, he knows that could prove to be a massive goal. Just look at his reaction. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Rodri. Alvarez. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Holland. Foden. Can he find the net? Off the post and back in play. Bernardo Silva. On to Holland. And fine goalkeeping.
Can someone get on the end of this? And still dangerous. It's Bernardo Silva. Oh, a vital piece of last-ditch defending. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Well, they seem to be onto something positive, but it faded away. Oh, good vision. And now the goal the City fans wanted to see. It's hard to see them throwing this away. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance. And I have to say, the finish is just brilliant from Bernardo Silva. He's such a good technician. It's a wonderful goal. And the ball is moving again. 2-0 is how it stands. Le Rager. Rasmus Falk Jensen on the ball. Very quick thinking there. Foden. Walker. Alvarez. It's a promising city move. But quick thinking defensively. So one minute of stoppage time. That's what the officials have said. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, he hasn't quite had the impact and attack that we were expecting, Stuart. Yeah, he's just not found his form today. He doesn't look quite right. Unless he can impose himself on this game and start threatening the keeper, they're going to lose this one. So back in business with City very much the dominant side. Can they repeat that in the second 45? And he takes on the shot. Might be a chance to break. Oh, fine play, and maybe it'll set something up. Phil Foden. The ball with Rodri. Erling Haaland. Physically strong and secure on the ball. Rodri. Now a potentially dangerous position for City. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Now well, the outcome is a free kick here. And they will make the change now. Well read to put an end to that attack. Silva. Alvarez. Well, they're quite content to knock it around inside their own half. Foden. Fluency of movement. Well, offside here. Such a pity for them. Chance was on. And Manchester City will go to their bench. Klaasson, 
and a tidy challenge 15 minutes left for play options in the center oh surely brilliantly blocked danger still on Foden with a textbook interception he's protecting it well The referee has decided to give the free-kick decision the way of City. Well, some referees might have reached for the yellow card, but not this one. Yeah, another foul, and he will get a yellow card, that's for sure. A change in the offing for City. Well, no stopping him. De Bruyne. And he takes it on. Well, breaking at pace is always a possibility. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. We've had the official word, there will be a minimum of two added minutes. Jack Grealish. Can he finish this? The save was a good one. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. It's a short one. And he cuts in from the wing. His determination there for all to see. Determined defending. No more time is left. The referee blows for full time. And Manchester City are the team sitting in the box seat at present in the context of this time. Well, that was a top quality performance. They were sharp in attack, they passed it with purpose, and they closed the ball down really quickly. This display gives them one foot firmly in the final. And the shining light this evening, no doubt about it, Bernardo Silva. Well, I thought his all-round game was excellent. It was his ability to find space that impressed me most, and with a bit more luck, he could have had a second one today. 